Okay, here we are at 230 Jackrabbit, Buta, Texas. It's a three bedroom, two and a bath, two and a half bath house. Quick scroll of the street here. All right. Let's go in and take a look. Now this garage is slightly deceiving. It is a one and a half car garage uh, due to the stairwell inside the house. All right. All right. And as you look ahead, you'll see that we're in our living area. Nice, big open living area. Very nice floors recently installed. Lots of windows. We're going to speed back a little bit. You can see we got the dining area over there. And the kitchen. Take a quick peek at the kitchen while we're over here. Refrigerator included with the rent. It is a courtesy item by the owner. And you see lots of cabinets, countertop space. You're good to go. You do need to bring your own microwave for this guy. All right, we're going to walk back here. This is our garage that we were just talking about. As you can see, the one and a half cars that we were speaking of. And we'll just kind of scroll around here and take a quick peek. There you are, the other half of the garage. Good storage. All right. Moving on. We're going to take a quick peek in the back, and then we'll go upstairs and check out the bedrooms. All right, you see we're fully fenced yard here. Good sized yard, plenty of room for the kiddos. Backing up a little bit, give you a good overview of the living area. Plenty of room for that big screen TV. You can see we've been freshly painted here as well. Coming through uh, right here next to the bathroom, by the way, is two things. Number one is our half bath. You can see we got the uh, facility there. And a pedestal sink here. And then we also have a basic closet here. All right. Headed upstairs. Okay, directly ahead of us are the two secondary bedrooms. We're going to go ahead and take a look at those and we'll backtrack to the master. So directly in front is, I apologize, this is the, uh, this is the master. So you see there's plenty of room, good size, plenty of room for a king size bed. And back on the other end there is the master bath. We'll take a quick peek at that too ceiling fan you saw. All right, so got a standard bathroom here. And then uh, as you can see, now well, hard to see, apologize the light bulb happens to be out, but we have a walk-in closet here. So you got plenty of space in there. All right. Move on across. So we're going to go ahead and make a quick turn here. This is the first of the two secondary bedrooms. Ceiling fan. Good size room. We'll spin around and take a look the other direction. You'll be able to see idea of space. Pretty good size. And we have a small walk-in closet right here. There we go. All right. We're going to 
going to move on down. So immediately to our right is going to be the laundry area, which is nice because you have an upstairs laundry. You don't have to haul everything downstairs. So you can see we got our hookups there. Electric hookup for a dryer, water for your washer, plenty of room in here. And back out into our right again is the secondary bathroom. So you can see we have a pretty standard bath right there. And last but not least is our bedroom number three. And again, pretty good sized bedroom. I believe it's a little bit larger than the last secondary bedroom. We're going to step back here, give you an overview. So pretty good size. Easily house a queen size bed. Even a king, really. And back here again, uh, you have another walk-in closet. Oh, there we go. All right. So that is our property for 230 Jackrabbit.